Hello everybody, it's look here and I'm making this super quick tutorial on uh, how to fix your Wi-Fi because uh, I've seen uh, quite a lot of people actually have this problem where uh, they say that their Wi-Fi doesn't work on their DS and that it does work but only with like games like black and white and black and white games, the newer games that have uh, better uh, Wi-Fi security setting thingies but Anyway, it's a really easy problem to fix, and oh my god, it's I know it's annoying. It's really annoying. I remember when I first got my Wi-Fi, I was really looking forward to playing on uh, Mario Kart DS, but then it just wasn't letting me. And by the time I fixed it, nobody played online on that game. So uh, it's really easy how to fix. Uh, you can just Google it on Google. <laughs> wow. Oh uh, yeah, you can just Google it on Google. And uh, just type in stuff like uh, how to fix my Wi-Fi settings or how to change my Wi-Fi password. And it should take you to some websites that are like this right here. But uh, this is the way it works for me. I, uh, I uh, My uh, router IP address is this one. So I'll just type in uh, 10.0.0.0.1. So 10.0.0. So I would... Probably, I, I would have to say you should try this one first. So type in this into your uh, browser. So just type in 10.0.0.1. So yeah, just open up a new tab right now and type this in. Uh, yeah, it's going to ask you for a username and password. Now, uh, for a lot of routers, the default username is going to be admin. I'm very horrible speller and password is going to just be password uh, I'm typing one of my hand right here now All right, I'm just hit, gonna hit remember password because why not and it takes me to this right here which is basically uh which is basically what's it called how do I say this it's like the settings page for your router so you can change all kinds of stuff from your router so uh I would say go to uh try to find this area i would say go to wireless and then right now my settings for this thing is that i don't have any passwords so anybody that like tries to find my router and wants to use it can just do it without putting in a password however i did check this off which uh right here that says enable scss broadcast so nobody can even find it so it's i don't know it's just so I don't have to remember a password. But basically, what here, what you do, your settings might be. Oh crap, no. Uh, your settings. Ah, oh, god damn it. Your settings might be like I don't know this crazy stuff. That means that things need to have like super security or something to be able to use it. And what you want to do is actually, I would say, lower it. So yeah, just like lower it down to the second lowest you can lower it all the way down to the one that says you don't need a password and I'm pretty sure it will work with everything you'll be able to use your DS and everything with your router however if you, there are like a lot of buildings and places around you I would I wouldn't recommend you not having a password I recommend you having at least the second highest uh, setting this yeah it doesn't look like I can do that so yeah this is basically how you do it you pretty much just type this IP address in you go into your wireless settings and then you try to look for a place that has like security options uh, it's if it's not working your DS and stuff then that means it's like too high and you're gonna want to lower it I would recommend if you can uh, I don't know why my for me this op the option of putting it on weep or WEP I believe that's what it is that's like the second highest security setting thingies I don't know why it's not appearing but I would recommend that one because for me that works with everything but since yeah I would recommend that one or the very lowest one that doesn't let that doesn't require you to have a, a password either one will do and uh, yeah so that is basically it afterwards you're pretty much gonna want to hit apply and uh, your internet might turn off from your PC like if you're uh, connected to your router by a wire by a laptop like I'm doing right now that's wireless you're probably gonna uh, lose a signal what I would recommend you do afterwards I don't know probably just uh, God, I kind of messed this up already but see it's it was kind of like just acting right now what I would recommend you do 
is just change the SSID name as well. That way you can just, I don't know, kind of just come down here, pick out the uh, connection you want to use, and you'll probably have less problems like that. But anyway, I'm kind of just rambling on. Uh, really, all I have to show you guys is that, yeah, you can just type in this IP address. The password is admin. No, not the username is admin. The password is password. And go to wireless and then, you know, just kind of mess around with these security options and yeah, I'm just rambling on now. Don't forget, if it doesn't help you or if uh, typing that IP address in there didn't help you, then yeah, just like, just look it up. Just use Google. It's really not that hard to change it. And uh, yeah, it's really not that hard. So uh, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope this helped. And uh, yeah, later, folks.